The Rocky Springs Church Cemetery is located about a mile south of Deerfield, Virginia on Route 600, also known as Marble Valley Road. We have veterans from wars going all the way back to the French and Indian War. There's a Confederate monument there honoring six local soldiers killed at the same day, the same battle, the Battle of Cedar Creek, October of 1864. Today we'll be spotlighting the grave of Colonel Thomas Hugger, or Hugh Hart. I'm not sure how it's pronounced. If anybody knows, you might let me know. But Tom, he received a land grant for his service in the French and Indian War where he achieved the rank of sergeant. September the 19th, 1780, he was appointed colonel of the 2nd Division of Augusta County Troops. May 1781, Hug Hart and his troops were ordered to join the Army of General Lafayette and was part of the army which pursued Cornwallis in his retreat. Uh, this was during the Yorktown siege and after. After the war, Hugger served as sheriff of Augusta County. He was one of the largest landowners of the county and very wealthy. His wife, Rebecca Estelle Hugger, is buried at the Rocky Springs Cemetery as well. The Daughters of the American Revolution have a chapter in Stanton named in his honor. So I hope you uh, learned a little something today about the colonel there. And there are many people buried in that cemetery that go back to some of the early uh, days of the community here. Some of the early settlers are buried there as well as uh, many uh, people in uh, modern day times. I'd like to thank uh, one of my tombstone tourists there for giving me these uh, pictures. And uh, they're going to be bringing me some more of them here. So we'll be sharing those with you as they scour around the countryside looking for uh, graves of uh, people. Confederate soldiers or American Indians or anyone we can find there. Maybe some unknown graveyards out there. We're going to try to bring them to you. So thanks for tuning in. Hope you have a great day.